morning. Let's talk about the sweet spot. Uh, what can you tell people about sweet spot training? What is it and why is it so important? The sweet spot training is an intensity and it's also a style of training. What makes sweet spot so good is it's a balance between intensity and the amount of training you can do. So you can do a lot of sweet spot training. And the best way to go about it is you can do intervals, you can do it on a group ride, you can use it, use it in racing. Um, a lot of ways to go about the sweet spot training. So the sweet spot is basically the zone between tempo and threshold, correct? That's correct. It's approximately 84 to 97 percent of your functional threshold power. So it's right smack dab in between as hard as you can threshold intervals and a tempo zone. This type of training can come into play for folks that are perhaps pressed for time, don't have the time to spend uh, you know, five or six hours out on the bike in a low intensity zone. They can get adaptation without putting as much time in. That's right. It's a great way to get more bang for your buck. Really good high quality workout and you can pack a lot of punch into even an hour ride with sweet spot training. The underlying principle is it's a balance between intensity and volume. Uh, it's called the sweet spot because it's uh, an intensity which increases your power output, but it doesn't create so much physiological strain that you can't do a lot of it. So you do a lot of it and get a big benefit and you get a lot faster. If you are recommending for your clients to go out and, and telling them to, to train in the sweet spot, what does that look like? I mean, is it a, is it a half an hour interval? Is it uh, go out and, and ride this as long as you can? How, how are you advising your clients? There's a lot of ways to do sweet spot training, and it can be as simple as three by 10 minutes on, 10 minutes off in your sweet spot intensity. It can come in the form of a group ride where you ride on the front of your group ride a little bit harder than you would on your own. Uh, it can be the hour of power, you know, your lunch ride. Just go out and just hammer it for a whole hour in your sweet spot intensity. Uh, it can also be, you know, go to a stage race and, you know, be active, race aggressively, you know, get in multiple days of uh, sweet spot training. For more on the sweet spot and more on training in general, visit trainingcenter at velonews.com. For Frank and his crew, I'm Brian Holcomb. Thanks for watching.